Tina Turner and Ike Turner's tumultuous marriage is well known from their first encounter to their divorce and beyond. Tina's account of their violent history, as documented in I, Tina, My Life Story, reveals that the abuse began when she expressed her desire to end the relationship with Ike after recording Fool in Love. He responded by hitting her in the head with a wooden shoe stretcher, instilling fear in her for the first time. Despite this, she admitted to caring about him and continued in the destructive relationship until a suicide attempt in 1968 due to an overdose of Valium. Tina attributed her feelings of hopelessness to Ike's continuous mistreatment and unfaithfulness. She recounted how their intimacy felt like a hostile act or even rape at times when accompanied by beatings. Furthermore, she detailed graphic instances of abuse fueled by cocaine use. What had been ugly and hateful between us before became worse with every snort of cocaine, she wrote. He threw hot coffee in my face, giving me third-degree burns. He used my nose as a punching bag so many times that I could taste blood running down my throat when I sang. In July 1976 at the Dallas Stadler Hilton, tensions between them escalated into a massive fight that marked a turning point for Tina. She left with virtually nothing but eventually went on to build an extraordinary career after filing for divorce weeks later. It means you're going to walk out of here with absolutely nothing. Except my name. It was finalized in 1978. Ike admitted his love for Tina and expressed remorse for his actions years later through an unsent letter. I still love Tina as much as I ever loved her. I wrote her a letter five years ago. I never sent it. I was telling her in this letter that I'm sorry for putting her and the kids through that kind of stuff. I was stupid. I was inconsiderate about her feelings. I understand today. She came from an abusive relationship and went straight to the top. Tina never appeared to forgive him fully. She emphasized this sentiment through candid interviews and participation in the HBO documentary titled, Tina. In 1993 Angela Bassett portrayed Tina Turner's painful experiences alongside Lawrence Fishburne as Ike Turner in the film, What's Love Got to Do With It?, inspiring others who lived through similar situations with its message of hope for love-filled futures free from fear. Ike Turner passed away on December 12, 2007 due to a cocaine overdose while Tina survived him until her death on May 24, 2023 after a prolonged illness.